Hello everyone, this is Imran Ali here and today we are going to talk about how to use fresh sales as a beginner. So as you can see over here, we are at freshsales.com and you will end up over here if you search on Google. So what are we going to do? We are going to sign up with my new account. So just click on sign up and you can see that we can sign up for a 21 day free trial. So you can either go with the sign up with email obviously or Google. I'm going with the Google and choose your account wait for it and it will ask you like uh, sign up for a day 21 day for trial but is it a company and if it's a company just go ahead and add your details so i'm just gonna do that and i'm gonna meet you at the dashboard of fresh sales so as you can see over here that this is the main dashboard of fresh sales and on the left side you have so many options over here on the right side top right side we have more options so right now we are looking at crm dashboard so this is the dashboard where everything you are going to work it will be over here obviously it's a sample report that how it will look like as you can see because this is the new account you can see that it has shown that this is how all the work will be looking like like pipeline trend all the different charts and that's it so just dismiss it and it will like I'm going to just close it and activities dashboard. This is the main dashboard where everything end up later. So on the left side, let's check them out. Uh, we have contacts and accounts, deals management, products, documents, sales conversation. These are some email things which you will find out and marketing things also, I guess. And uh, forms, if you want to create forms, you can also do that. Analysis, obviously and settings normal so right now what are we going to do that so we are going to take a look at contacts so click on contacts and it will take you right over here and this is the sample contact as you can see over here or you can just import it if you want like from the excel sheet like google contacts and uh, there are multiple things out there otherwise obviously you will have to add uh, obviously manually so how you can do that just click on here and you can see there are multiple things which you can do directly and this option is available on every page by the way so just click on add contacts add their name and details everything if you want and uh, that's it just go ahead and save it and it will take you right over here close every single thing and here we are so all the details of that person will show up over here and all the leads what you have done and what they have done so far you can find them over here activities and every single thing you will find it over here you can set the integration you can set the notes if you want for the particular uh, like person obviously they can see that and you can set the task if you want from here like add task and obviously you need to add the title description task type outcome due date and uh, who assigned that who re is related to and save it later and it will show up over here obviously so these are the meetings which you can set like if you set a meeting for like if you want to talk about something obviously it's a very simple thing this is all about the crm like how you are going to uh, communicate with your team and your customers so this is all on you so it's a very basic thing which you can do and you can just go ahead and go back to contacts and you will find that over here so as you can see over here it says open deals amount so what are the deals so you need to add deals first so you can see everything over here so for the deals you need to go at deals menu and add deals or otherwise just go ahead and click over here add deal once you click on it start typing i'm just going to write random thing like youtube and uh, i'm going to set the value like 10 or thousand if you like just for this tutorial obviously it's a beginning tutorial and who is related to this uh, deed just click on it search it if you want i'm just gonna search it yep here we are click on it obviously you can see on the as you can see on the left side like uh who are we going to assign this deal and account name if you want and just save it so this is the deal which we have created and obviously it's in deals section if you click on deals you will end up over here and all the section and the crm method over here has been created you can see that you can just grab it and uh obviously for uh, 
transfer it to the follow-up and you can just go ahead like under review or demo negotiation it's all on you obviously you can just search it if you want you can just click on open all views just click on it and you can like filter it out and focus on a particular thing so or you can just go ahead and filter out there are multiple things obviously it's not just for one person this is for a huge company or obviously for a small company too so that's it this is all you need to know about like how to add deals and i have told you about the task products if you have any products you can just add products and add products like uh, uh, to your crm if you want and edit filters if you want or just directly click on import products uh, you can just drag and drop the file over here and that's it this is all very simple which you need to know and i'm just letting you all know every single thing because obviously what are the contacts i have just told you deals i have just told you products i have just told you so these are very basic things which you need to know and uh, this is all the crm uh at fresh desk uh fresh sales sorry uh allowing you to do that so you can also add documents so everyone can see that it's a very basic thing which you are going to do sales and conversation if you click on sales and conversations the first option you can see that inbox so what are inbox you can see over here connect your inbox to fresh sales so you are going to connect your google account microsoft account or any other account just click on others you will find multiple more uh you can just connect them to your fresh sales account so you can just go ahead and do your work at one place you just don't need to open different tabs for different work you can do all the work over here you can do writing and you can check the check out the emails and everything and there are multiple filtering out there which you can do that also and filtering is uh, i think it's a very big thing because obviously you need to manage things accordingly and i believe they have set this up very clean and decently so this is a very good option and you can set the email templates obviously you need to send emails you can do that too sales sequence is a different thing and it's a different tutorial i can tell you about this later bulk email like you can send a bulk of email like at once so obviously it's very normal to know so if you click on phone you can just add the logs if you want and it's very basic things which you can like if you come over here you will explore it to your side and you will understand every single thing like what is going on and you can just click on sms voicemail drop simple as that and uh, obviously if you click over here you can do all the things right over here too like add tasks add meeting add call logs it's, it's these all are the shortcuts of all of these things so last but not least analytics so obviously you can see all the reports over here and i don't know why it's showing every single thing, thing to me and so just close all of that and you can see over here like everything you are going to work on this account it will create a report everyone who are going to attach with your account and work in your account or doing uh, different activities it will take a report automatically obviously so it's very easy to understand like what is going on or otherwise whatever you are going to do it will end up over here you can just add uh, like uh, team activity report click on it and it will show up over here like what is going on emails phone calls how many appointments have been set sales activities tasks so you can just go ahead and do like view it accordingly and uh, this is very easy these all are shortcuts also and obviously you can just search them from over here in all of these options so it's very easy everything has been filtered out and everything is in front of you everything has been set up very decently you can just go ahead and just click on things and it will start working on it so i think for the beginning tutorial it's a lot to take in and i believe uh, i believe you understand every single thing just come over here explore it to yourself and i make sure that you will understand every single thing that i have said right now so thank you for watching this video i hope you understand what i try to say please leave a like and subscribe if you have any queries and any questions comment down below Thank you for watching this video. Bye-bye. We will meet again.